Hi there, my name is Shaker Iyer. I'm the CEO of Arcus, and I'm here to announce something uh, super exciting today, uh, which is an investment that we have just received from NVIDIA, the leaders in AI. And along with them, they are being joined by Prosperity7, uh, the venture arm of Saudi Aramco, as well as Hitachi Ventures, uh, and uh, General Catalyst, as well as Clear Ventures. Now, as you all know, um, AI, most of the focus today is on training LLMs, but underneath this is an infrastructure that is required to make AI work. And many of you know about GPUs and the need for GPUs. What is increasingly happening though, is that there is a need for distributed compute infrastructure that is used efficiently in order to deliver the caliber and the volume of AI processing that is required today and that will be required in future. This growth will invariably require a better use of processor capacity, as well as an architecture that pulls in compute muscle from all across the globe. And so Arcus networking through Arc OS and our network operating system has been uniquely designed to make this happen in a very efficient way. So how do we do this? First and foremost, we work with uh, uh, data processors with uh, DPUs uh, like Bluefield from NVIDIA. And so when you combine Arc OS with Bluefield, it allows the customer to then offload a number of functions from the compute infrastructure to a parallel uh, processing world, for example, networking functions. And this in turn then frees up cycles for doing more efficient AI. The other side of this is that we can take an architecture that was otherwise very consolidated into like uh, closely clustered GPUs and extend that to racks in a data center, to in between data centers, data center to edge, data center to the telco infrastructure, as well as to the cloud. And that flexible distributed networking fabric is also coming from Arcus which once again is our uh, uniquely designed ArcOS uh, operating system. Thank you for joining us today, and this is uh, a, a super exciting time for all of us. Mm -hmm.